feels like rendezvous You know what to do Keep your love for me only I get high on you Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. So today I'm doing a Shein haul, Shein, 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 I don't know how you pronounce it, but I'm gonna say Shein. Um, I ordered these things quite a long time ago, probably about like two months ago. I ordered them before I was supposed to go on vacation. So it was like the end of June, maybe like a month and a half ago. Um, and they did take a while to come in. I don't even know how I heard about Shein. I think I was like scrolling through Instagram or like Facebook and it was there on like the sponsored thing. And I was like, oh, that's really cute. Let me go check it out. So, okay, a couple things. They are a, I believe they're from China. I believe everything is shipped from China. I think they're a Chinese brand. Um, the sizing, you have to pay attention to the size chart. And even sometimes when you do, the items don't work out. And I'll show you that in a little bit. But I don't hate it. Like I had never heard of it before. I didn't see any like YouTube videos about it before I even bought anything. Um, I didn't hate it. Two of the things really worked out for me. A couple of the other things would work out if they were tweaked a little bit. Um, I ordered everything in a size 3X. That being said, definitely, definitely check out the size chart because I believe some of the items go to a 5X, but the 5X is really like a 3X. So you have to definitely check the size chart. Everything is priced super, super affordably. I got six things. It was under $100, so you can kind of see how cheap the things are. Now, the quality of the items aren't the best. Um, I'm gonna just jump right in and show you the first thing because so we can like talk about it. Um, the first thing I got was this tropical leaf print kimono, which of course fits absolutely fine. Um, just your regular kimono with your regular short sleeves. Could double up as a bathing suit cover up. Um, it's pretty thin. It does feel, it just feels like your regular kimono. Sorry, this strap keeps falling. It's one of those like self-adjustable straps and I need Henrik home to like tighten it for me because I can't do this one on my own. Um, but the quality of this is not the best. Now I'm gonna show you, there's like some, a bunch of like loose strings hanging out everywhere um, here as well. It's just, it's not the best quality, but it was super cheap. It fits well, it was affordable, and I don't know, I think it's cute. I really like the way this looks. I wore this twice. Once I wore it with like a black wrap, kind of crop top underneath and some black shorts. The next time I wore it with a black tank and black leggings and just threw this over it and it looked so chic and tropical and summery and cute. So I actually really liked this. Um, I do not have the prices since I bought it like months ago. Uh, I'm gonna go ahead and try to look through my email and see if I can find every single item so I can link it for you. If I can't, I will link the website obviously for you. Um, so you can go ahead and look for them if you want to, but this one actually worked out and it was affordable. I like this one. I've worn this one twice. I like this one. The next thing is kind of the same print. Obviously, I bought all these things for vacation, so I was thinking like tropical vibes. Um, it's the same print and it's like a little skater dress. So it looks like this, it's a high necked dress, has little short sleeves, and then the waist goes in and flares out. It's very cheap fabric. It is super thin. Can you still see me? Cause I can still see everything through it. Um, I don't know if you can tell, but it's super, super thin as far as the fabric goes. But this one's not falling apart. Like I don't see any seams that are ripping. I don't see anything like that. It seems pretty well made. There's no like loose ends anywhere. It just, this one doesn't fit. This one is too tight on my chest, which is what I found with a lot of the dresses is they fit everywhere else. The arms fit fine, the waist fit fine, the hips fit fine, but they're surprisingly really, really tight in the chest. And I don't have big boobs, but I think it's just not wide enough in the chest area. Like, cause I have a broad, I have broad shoulders and a broad back. I think it's just not wide enough and that's my problem, but it is really cute and it looks really cute on. I'm gonna try it on for you. You're gonna see what I mean. It's like super tight and like compresses my boobs. It makes me look like I am totally flat chested um, cause it's just super tight, but not bad. Oh my God, this strap's gonna drive me nuts. <laughs> so the next dress I had the same problem with. It's super cute and this one is big enough. Like it looks, it's really big. <laughs> it looks like a true 3X. It has a vertical blue and white stripe and then down the center it has this like tropical vibe to it with some fringe detailing right there at the waist. It is a skater style dress. This one has longer sleeves that you can button close like that. 
Um, it's really cute. I mean, this is like adorable. This is like a little baby doll style dress. It's just too tight in the chest and that bothers me because I thought this is so, so cute, so summery, so like tropical. I loved it, but it just did not work out for me. The material on, the material on this again is very, very thin. And that is definitely something that I am seeing a lot um, with these dresses. This one has a couple of loose ends and it's just, you could just tell it's not made well. I mean, they're just cheap, but it's fast fashion. It's affordable fashion. The sizing doesn't work, but I don't hate the brand. Like I did watch a couple of videos now since I've had this stuff and everyone's like really hating on them. And I don't, I don't hate them. Like I, I think some of the stuff works. It's definitely a hit or miss. If I were to shop this website again, I would definitely look for items that contain stretch in them. And actually, if you go on the website and you click on an item, it'll literally tell you this item does not contain stretch or this item does contain stretch and what it's kind of made out of so you can kind of gauge if it's gonna work for you. The only reason why these didn't work is because the chest is too tight. So if I was probably a size 18 or 20, probably like an 18, these would work out perfectly on top. Okay. The next thing is a shirt that I've worn three times. I've washed it, I love it. It is this little yellow shirt that has sunflowers or daisies, I don't really know which all over it. It's a stretchy like knit fabric. Um, and then it has a waist tie right there. So it kind of cinches in your waist. You can adjust that. It's really cute. It's like another little like baby doll style but it has the waist cincher. It's cute, I really like the way this fits. You guys have seen this one before but I'll still try it on for you. The back has a little keyhole detail like that, again in a size 3XL. Yeah, it says made in China, so this is a Chinese brand. Love it, I mean, I would see this at like Forever 21. I like it, I really like this top. The next dress, okay, so the next couple things are both dresses. This one was not fitting me at all anywhere. Um, and it's this like linen type of fabric, white spaghetti strap dress. It's so adorable, it has a little sweetheart neckline and then an empire waist and then it goes all the way down to like a midi style this one wasn't fitting me like no way about it was not gonna fit me I gave this one to my mom my mom's currently a size 12 and this fits her so this one the sizing was really off on so this was a no-go for me but it's so adorable it has little pockets and everything it's so cute it just doesn't work <laughs> And then the last thing is another dress that just doesn't work for me. Again, I gave it to my mom, a size 12, and it fits her nicely. Um, it is this little like cold shoulder dress. There's an opening right here, floats out, and then you cinch the waist in. This looked a lot cuter online, in my opinion. Um, it just, it wasn't, it's not doing it for me. But that being said, there's no loose ends. I can't see anything physically wrong with it. Um, it just feels like a cheap dress. So as far as Shein goes, I would definitely say if you are going to order from them, check out their size chart. Be sure you're looking at their size chart. Check to see if the item that you're looking at contains stretch um, and kind of go from there. You can't return to them, I don't believe. So a lot of these things, I don't know what to do with. I, I was gonna put them on my Poshmark. Let me know if you guys would be interested in buying them. Um, I'd be selling them for super cheap because they're super cheap. <laughs> but I don't know, if not, I'll probably just donate them or I don't know, see if I can give them to a friend or something, I don't know. But yeah, <laughs> I don't hate Shein, I really don't. I think they're very hit or miss. Obviously things with stretch work, kimonos, things like that are gonna work fine because they're open and flowy. Things that are you know up here and don't have stretch, that's where you're gonna kind of run into your problem. Um, but I would say check it out. It's very affordable. Just be very conscious when you're shopping the website to look and see like the small print, see the details, see the size chart, things like that. So yeah, <laughs> that's my opinion on Shein. Um, if you guys like this video, be sure to give it a thumbs up. Let me know in the comment section down below if you would wear any of these, if you like any of these, if you've tried Shein, what you thought about it, because I'm curious to know like other people's thoughts. I've seen a lot of negative reviews on YouTube, but I don't hate it. <laughs> So I love you guys so much and I'll talk to you soon. Bye.